One of the biggest challenges I believe professional sellers have today, or one of the biggest barriers to breakthrough performance, is that they're presenting to share information, not presenting to earn a commitment. Every touch point with a customer is a defining moment and an opportunity to advance the relationship. And every touch point should have a commitment objective. Now, a commitment objective it isn't always about getting a signed contract. It's about moving the relationship forward to that moment of truth. That's the law of incremental commitment. Typically, in a complex sales environment like yours, a sale would include a series of incremental commitments that ultimately leads to the win-win outcome. My business was the same way, and we, we actually put in place, part of our sales methodology, three questions that we could use post-client engagement that elevated our ability to both analyze if we earn commitment and created some impetus around us doing it. And here, here are the three questions. I'll, I'll share them with you. The first one was this. At the, at the end of every sales call, you just have to answer, what commitment did I earn? Because, well, you know, they're gonna, we're going to talk to them in six months. You know, that's not a commitment. That's I'm not interested in doing business with you. So even if it was incremental, we're going to look at some research. We've got another meeting in two weeks that includes more decision makers. That's a commitment. The second one I think is very, very important. Commitment-oriented sellers get specific. They try and create a timeline around the commitment. And then the third thing that we found incredibly effective was confirming those incremental commitments in writing. And it also gave us an opportunity to add additional value to the conversation. Follow up in an email. Send a LinkedIn invitation. I agreed to do this. You agreed to do that. We agreed that we're going to connect again in two weeks and have this next conversation. And this really became part of our culture and part of our sales methodology. I, I knew it took hold when I had other people in the sales organization asking each other, hey, what's your commitment objective? What commitment did you earn? What are the next steps? What's your timeline? And when that kind of opportunity spreads, the team is better prepared to go to market, compete, win, and achieve breakthrough sales performance.